Okay, how are we doing out there today? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using Ambient Light Rejection. Technology Gain Times 4 and 5. Now today we are using our Illuminous Screen Paint outside. We're using a Sony 1100 Lumina Projector. That's 720p. Got the measuring tape out. We're going to go outside and show you how far we're actually from our screen. Alright, so let's show you. So there's the measuring tape here. And we are around 12 feet. There's the projector right there, the model number, so you can look it up for yourself. So that is a 1100 lumen projector. Outside around, let me get the time. Of, so we're around 7.32 in the morning. I'm going to show you what our screen is pulling up. Now the white sheet of paper just represents those of you who have white projection screens, just showing you exactly how much you're missing. And just to show you how powerful this technology that we can be around 12 feet back and a little bit of change. And we can actually do this on 1100 lumens outside in the morning hours. And this is on our Luminous Superior screen paint. Now, we're going to tack a little challenge onto this demonstration. Uh, we challenge a certain individual to take your screen paint outside, not on that little awning, that little roof area that you have, and none of that. Take it outside on a projector under 1200 lumens, 12 feet back, and do this outside. Uh, of course, you can't get any more ambient light than this. And let's see what your technology pulls up. Now, I guarantee you in three days, this, this challenge will not be done. And as I said before, and I'll say it many times, black technology is superior over anything else on the market. This is the reason why I can sit out here on 1100 lumen projector at 12 feet back and pull an image up. Not only that, our technology has is the only one with the ambient light rejection technology gain times four and five. Now, if any other screen is claiming to have such abilities, they would have no problem doing this complete, doing the same demonstration or better. Now, reason why I have the measuring tape going off the porch, because I want you to see that the um, porch in no way is blocking any ambient light that's in contact with the screen. My screen is completely off the porch. Now, one of the most hardest demonstrations, and I can't wait for this one to be done, we are going to do the star field demonstration. Now, this will show whether or not if your screen really has true contrast. See that right there? I'm going to go outside for just a minute. I've got to bring my camera down, keep in mind, because we've got a car rolling past. i got to bring it down. But I'll show you. Right up close. So this is called a star field demonstration. Now, we do the star field demonstration. It shows up exactly if you are getting true contrast from your screen or you're not. But this is something you can't achieve with a lighter screen. They can't produce contrast. Now you can see the measuring tape comes in, like I said, at around 12 feet. So, we're going to put this up as a bit of a challenge to Mr. Uh, Mr. J. If you want to claim your technology to be so amazing, all you would have to do is do the exact same demonstration I just did. Now, this is the reason why we know that when people try to say that our technology doesn't work and it's just that and the other but yet they will never ever do the exact same demonstrations that we do and as I said before if our screens can pull up an image on 1100 lumen projector outside with no problem whatsoever and this is 1100 lumens usually most projectors I use outside or around 4,200 lumens, 35, because that's the requirement. But if I'm doing this at 1,100 lumens outside with no problem whatsoever, then how in the world is a 3,000 lumen projector ultra short throw not going to show up on the screen? That's the question right there. Now also too, like I said, this is going to be a challenge for Mr. J. We'll give you three days. 
all you got to do is take a projector under 1200 lumens, take it out there on the, in the back, no awnings, no protection, nothing. The screen has to be out in the elements, out in the open, and it has to be sitting back more than 10 feet or 11 feet from the screen. Your projector has to be sitting back that far. And let me give you the hour of time. Now we've done this between seven and eight. You can do this around seven to eight, you can do this around 12, it's up to you. Now I can show a demonstration easy, back in our technology, doing a demonstration at around seven or eight o'clock in the morning with no problem whatsoever. Question is, can you do it? All right, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'm Kenneth Bird from Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using Ambient Light Rejection. Technology game times four and five. Like I said, we back up what we can do over here. I can show off my screens in fully lit environments. I don't have to worry about my screens washing out and fading. Keep in mind, this is a 4,000 lumen projector at around 14 feet back. Now, if 1,100 lumens can show up on this and can do it outside, keep in mind, this right here would be a cake wall for any projector. All right, thank you all for your time. I have to go and God bless. Look at that. Just want to show you that. Look at that. At 1100 lumens, I put my camera down for a minute. At 1100 lumens, look at that. Oh, I forgot to add too. The screen has to lay flat against the wall. No slanting it to the side too also. Just want to put that out there. So make sure we cover all the bases. All right. Thank you all for your time. I got to go.